Okay, today I'm going to show you how to find a path to a file or folder. Um, so what we're going to do first is we're going to go down to the Start menu. Now this is in Windows Vista and press on the Start icon and go up and choose Documents. Okay, so now the Documents folder opens up. Now instead of, um, in Windows XP we used to have the path written here and we could just copy the path to the file. Uh, but now we don't, okay? So to get that there, we need to right click in this on this bar here and then a menu comes up. Now we can copy the address, copy the address as text or edit the address. Now I like to edit the address just so I can see what it is. So if you press on that, there we go, there's the path to the folder. Okay, so that is the actual path to the documents folder on this computer. Okay, so if we go to the pictures and maybe we'll go into another folder. Okay, so now let's do the same thing. We'll edit the address and see what comes up. And there we go, there's the path. Okay, now that's um, sometimes, you know, you need to type in the path to something and um, this is the way to get it. Now, because it's selected blue, we can right click on it and choose copy. Okay, now we can just go on, we can open up a um, notepad document and we can paste it into there, I'll show you. There we go. Okay, so there's the path to that folder. That folder is called New Articles. I'll close that and just say uh, I don't want to save it. Um, anyway, I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.